Hi and welcome to another Intel Tech Tip. Today we'll be looking at what you have when it comes to brakes. So today we'll be looking at the varieties of brakes that will be provided on your caravans and what bearings to use. And very important as well, what grease. Now, first of all, the first brake that you'll be receiving is a 10 inch drum brake. This 10 inch drum brake will be normally found on your Alco leaf spring systems where um, it's the smaller variation, it's the one where it's quite the basic system, it's very popular however. Secondly, we'll be looking at the 12 inch brake system. So 12 inch brake system is a little bit more robust, a little bit larger braking capacity as well as a larger bearing that'll be used. After the 12 inch, you will get the 12 inch disc brakes. Now the disc brake uses the same bearings with the same load rating capacity. So the disc brakes gives you a little bit more comfortability in changing your brake pads and for, for more off-roading, that'll be a great one to use. Now, coming over to this side, we have a UniHub. This is new tech. This is new technology. The bearing inside of this drum is nothing like what we see in front of us. The ones we see in front of us here are roller bearings. They are the old school version which uses grease. So that means there's maintenance, there's repacking, there is a lot of work and fine care that needs to be taken to keep these babies going. When we look at the UniHubs, the bearings inside here are from a Toyota Hilux. These bearings is a very, very strong and robust seal bearing. Now this sealed bearing is doesn't need to be maintained, doesn't need to be touched in 100,000 kilometers. So in the 10 inch drum, you've got a L68149, so which is a parallel bearing. So this little bearing here, you've got your cone, which is the roller bearing, and you have your cup. When you get this serviced, you need to insist and ensure that your cups has been changed, because these cups also wear and get heat deformation on the inside. Those are pressed into the drum. Now your bearings seats into that and because it's parallel bearings, both of the bearings are exactly the same. So the inner bearing and the outer bearing are the same. So with that said, that is your 10 inch drum. If you wanna see how you identify that, if you go to your drum, it's a much smaller diameter as well as it is noted on the drum itself. So it says 10 inch by 2.25, all right? So moving on from the 10 inch, we have the two 12 inch brake systems. So we've got the drum brake as well as the disc brake. Now these two systems runs the same bearing styles. So the bearings used in these, these, uh, these brake setups are the smaller bearing. This is a tapered roller bearing system. So what that means is the outer bearing is a smaller bearing and the one closest to the suspension arm is a larger bearing. So the smaller bearing number is 15123 and also the larger bearing number is 25580. Now these two bearings, it's very important that you ensure that they are Japanese bearings. You wanna have the longevity and reliability of them. Both of these setups here uses the same style bearings. So when we talk about grease, it's very important that you insist on a lithium complex grease. The reason for that is, or wheel bearing grease, lithium complex wheel bearing grease, the reason for that is when this grease heats up, you will get oil bleed through your seals and you'll see leaking on the inside of your rim or even patches on the ground. Also, your grease will be dispersing from your actual drum. So if you ask for lithium complex, it will remain in there and it'll do what it is supposed to be doing inside of your braking system. Servicing of the, the bearings, these are a safety critical component of your caravan or your chassis. So engaging the services of a professional is critical. It's very important. This is not something you want to be doing in your backyard. So if there's anything I can ask you today is please engage the services of somebody who knows what they're doing and can do it professionally. That sums it up for us today with the, with the braking systems and the bearings. Hope this information found you well. Cheers. Catch you on the next one.